Hi guys. Um, so it's been a month and a few days since I've talked to you last. So hi everyone. I hope everybody's doing great. Um, I'll go ahead and get to the stats quickly. Um, I was 269 in, let's see, month 9, last month, the 18th, 269. Um, this month I weighed in and I lost 14 pounds, so I'm down to 255. Uh, 248 is the lowest I've weighed as an adult. So, guys, I'm so excited. I am almost in brand new territory. Yes, all of the pounds that I've lost so far are 165 pounds. And they're all old pounds. Old fat that I've gained and lost. Gained and lost. So, that's kind of discouraging when you think about it like that. But when you think about that I only have, like, what? I don't know. Six pounds? Seven pounds to go? Yeah, seven pounds to go. Uh... And I'll be in new territory. That's exciting. That keeps me mo motivated. As do you. Um, thanks for watching the videos and making comments and giving me some really helpful feedback. Um, shout outs to everyone who um, suggested the five day pouch test. Um, lose a lot, Care Bear. Thank you. Mwah. I love you. Um, that really helped me get going. Um, just to retrain my brain and retrain my pouch to work correctly the way it's supposed to um because you know we all get like on those little binge binges where we're eating the slider food because it just goes right down and it doesn't make you feel uncomfortable and it's just easy to do and so i needed to get out of that habit and go back to you know right after surgery when we're on fire and we're um uh, you know, gung-ho and willing to do anything it takes, and so, uh, anyways, that, that really helped me to get back on track and refocus, and, uh, so that's, that's working out for me. Um, so, school is out, I'm a school bus driver, and I did Census Bureau f there for a little while, but that has kind of come to an end for a brief time, for about three weeks, I'll have a vacation from that. So, I'm really able to concentrate on losing the weight and working out, and so, um, I hired a personal trainer. His name is Quinn. Hey, um, he is fantastic. He's like a Marine, uh, tough, but nice, um, and funny. And he, and he makes me laugh. And, uh, he like has more confidence in me than I have in myself. So he, he expects me to, to, handle what he throws at me and to, so far so good I can't believe it I've already done things that I just did not think there was any way I could do some of the things he's asked me to do because I just have no upper body strength and that's changing um, I don't know if you can see it yet let's see let me make a muscle this is so embarrassing okay maybe not <laughs> not yet but soon, soon you'll see a muscle there, eventually. Um, but anyway, uh, I digress. He, he's working me out Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I'm doing Aqua Zumba on Saturday. I walk five miles on Tuesday, Thursday. I'm doing water aerobics in between. Um, and I'm thinking of doing like a beginner's yoga class because I think I probably need the stretching after working my muscles out so much. So, but I'm just thankful that, you know, even though I don't have a paycheck right now, I'm able to concentrate on working out. So, um, that, that's a good thing. Especially because I have that lofty goal I set, if you remember. Yeah, I got to get like to 220 by August 18th. So that's like what? Mm, one, two, three, four, five. Five weeks in July. Uh, got a little more than a week left in this month so that's six seven eight it's about eight or nine weeks to get off uh what 255 so 220 30 40 50 uh 35 pounds 35 pounds in about eight to nine weeks i don't know if it's attainable or not but i'm going to do my darndest to try to get there um so i cut my hair um i have lost a lot of weight i mean lost a lot of hair um, in the process of losing the weight um, from having the surgery and so I went in just for a trim a few weeks ago and she was like what is all this weird stuff and I said yeah it's new growth it's like little sprigs of hair trying to grow back so she's like well 
it's 101 here every day and you came in here wearing your hair up so why don't you just cut it and I thought you know eh, you got a point so that way if I want to grow it out again it'll all be caught up and I can do it all together all together so um, what else oh I'm late making the video because I went to Colorado Springs to see my sister and um, I'm happy to report that I actually was able to unload the car and carry all the luggage up and down the steps no problem usually the whole family had to pitch in and come and get everything and help me up the steps too um, so that was I could tell I've come a long way when I did that um, unloading the car and getting up the steps I mean I was just flying up those steps like nothing <laughs> and that was just a great feeling um, my sister's lost a lot of weight. She looks so good. She's lost about 88 pounds. She's down to 176. And it was kind of a glimpse into the future, maybe what I'll look like when I get down to that weight. So I was really excited to see her. And she was very proud of me. And my nephew's cracking me up. He's whistling at me and making me laugh. So it was a great visit. Um, she's coming down uh, this weekend, actually. Um, and shout out to Jody, by the way. Um, who knew? We could have just had the reunion at the Y. Everybody get on a bike or a treadmill and conversate. <laughs> we, we didn't need to get a place and order food and everything. <laughs> we go for, what, 15 years? We don't see each other. And then randomly we run into the gym at 7 a.m. So funny. Um, anyways, it was good to see you. And uh, you look great. And... I can't wait to really catch up with you um, on the weekend. So looking forward to meeting up with everybody from Harris Avenue Baptist Church Youth Group. We're going to have a blast. Um, and it's my mom's birthday on Friday. Um, she's turning the big 7-0. And she always said she wanted to be moved into a retirement community by the time she turned 70. She put her name on a waiting list like in December of last year and lo and behold three weeks ago they call her up and say hey we have an apartment available. So the last month's been, well the last three weeks has been a nightmare like her friend Bobby did most of the work. Me and Leonard and some of my mom's friends pitched in but um, so shout out to Bobby. You're just like an amazing friend and workhorse girl. You do more work than most men I know. Um, so we got her moved into her apartment and she's set up and ready to go on vacation and uh, we've actually got a buyer for her house. I'm signing paperwork on that on Friday so the house will be sold on her birthday. I had a good long cry today walking through the house just remembering my my years growing up there I've been in that house since I was I guess nine months old and I slept in a, a dresser drawer for a baby bed when we moved back from Colorado to Texas and I just remember working puzzles and playing dominoes with my grandpa and my grandma cooking all those good meals and <sighs> sitting there tatting and I remember me being a little pest and I put the music on. I, they had this old um, antique record radio and, and record player and I'd, I'd put a record on and I'd make Mama Mom and Papa get up and dance in the middle of the living room floor even when they didn't want to just to entertain me, to keep me quiet. It was so fun and so I'm just really going to miss the house but I'm so excited. We're selling it to the next door neighbor and we've known them since, I don't know, the 70s. So. It's almost, almost like it's going to family. So that kind of is reassuring. I'm sure they'd let me, you know, come sneak a peek once in a while if I started feeling like I was missing the place too much. So anyway, um, I guess that's all I have to report at this point. Um, next month, I'll check back in again. Hopefully, I will have lost about... Ugh, I don't know. I'm thinking 20 pounds because I was a little shy. I needed to lose like 17, 18 pounds a month for the next three months to hit my goal in August. But I was a little shy this month, so I'm hoping with a personal training um, I can maybe get 20 out of, out of myself this month. We'll see. So, um, I guess that's it. Uh, have a great month. Um, I miss you guys. Thank you for watching the videos and uh, making your comments and giving me the feedback and the helpful suggestions. I appreciate that very much. You guys are just awesome. 
So have a good one and I will talk to you soon. Bye.